Hello everyone, this is Dan Sparse and welcome back to Let's Play Star Wars Knights of the Old Republic. We're actually going to go into this apartment because I think one of the bounties is in here. Get out of here you goggle-eyed freak! You're too ugly for the upper city. Yeah, go back to where you came from. We don't want your kind up here. But horrible children. Hey, you kids, leave that Thorian alone. Why do you care what happens to some scummy alien? He's just a freak. Yeah, he isn't even supposed to be in the upper city. Get out of here, you punks, or you'll be the ones in pain. Oh, run for it! <laughs> Uh, you should be okay now. I'm glad I could help. Got some experience for that. Now I think one of these is Largo. Yeah, Largo's right over here. So. What, what do you want now? Uh, maybe I could help you with your problem with Davik. I don't think anyone can help me. I owe Davik money, and I was late with the payment. So he went to Zach's in the bounty office and put a price on my head. I've been hiding here ever since. But sooner or later, someone will find me. Unless I somehow come up with another 200 credits. I'm a dead man. Eh, I'm just gonna kill him. It's gonna make it a lot easier. I knew you were here to kill me. Well, I won't go down without a fight. Sorry. <laughs> I don't mean to be a bad guy, just... It's so much easier. And what was this thing that I got? It's not a belt. What is it? Energy projector. Oh, it's an upgrade for something. All right. Sorry. <laughs> uh. All right. So that's one bounty. Now we're gonna go ahead, and now we're gonna actually head over to the other apartment. Deal with the other bounty. Now, I don't know where the other people are. I don't remember. I know they're somewhere. But I legitimately don't remember where. Well. We'll go to this apartment first, and then we'll figure it out. Seems like the best option. Which one is it? Oh, it's the other way. Maybe I will buy something from this guy now that I think about it. Not in there. Wait a minute. She has just a normal Twilight girl. Hey, Larum. Uh, let me see what you got for sale. Alright. We're gonna sell some stuff. Sell battle stimulant. Sell that. Energy projector. Go ahead and sell that. Let's see. Military suit. Can't wear that. Heavy combat armor. Light battle armor. Couple of blasters, a mine. I think I'll risk it. Oh, there's remains over here. Nice. Yoink. Hey, dear. You're back. Did you did you manage to get Holden to withdraw the price on my head? 
I'll remove the bounty on your head if you pay him off. I have nothing. I barely make enough credits to get by. I can't afford to pay that pig off. I guess I have no choice but to stay here and hope Holden cools down. With that bounty on my head, it's too dangerous to go outside. Uh, you're back. Did I'm sorry. Then you're going to learn the same lesson. <laughs> I'm very sorry. Let's go. Thank <laughs> <laughs> you. Uh, Does she not have any remains? I guess she doesn't. Oh, there's a back over here. I didn't even notice that. Oh. Empty. Lame. Oh, she didn't drop anything. Lame. So I'm gonna just quickly go to the apartment. Which should heal us, right? Yep. And it did. Good. We're gonna add Karth. We're gonna head on out. Oops. Where's the elevator? Upper city. Dia's apartment. Upper city. Okay. So that's two of them down. I don't know where the other one is, to be honest. Um, let's, let's look around a bit more before we finish everything else off. Didn't go in there yet. Oh, a medical facility. Let's go in here. Gurney. Can't you see I'm busy with my do? Go talk to Zelka. I see from your appearance that you are an off-worlder. Still, you are welcome here. I'll not have it said that Zelka Foreign refused to help somebody just because they weren't a citizen of Terrace. Do you require healing or medical supplies? I can treat almost any injury or ailment right here at the medical facility. Except the rat ghoul disease, of course. Rat ghoul disease? The terrible affliction has plagued Terrace for many generations. It is spread by the Rat Ghouls, horrible monsters that live in the Undercity below Terrace's great skyscrapers. Prolonged exposure to the Undercity breeds the disease, and those infected will eventually mutate into Rat Ghouls themselves, becoming mindless beasts that feed on the flesh of others. Gross. Is there no cure? Mm, there is no antidote for the disease. Though I heard the Republic scientists at the military base here on Terrace were close to perfecting a cure. Then the Sith arrived. They overran the military base, and now they refuse to allow anyone access to the laboratories inside. The Sith are keeping all the serum for the patrols they send into the Undercity. If I could just get my hands on a sample of that serum, the Rat Ghoul disease could be wiped from the face of Terrace forever. But I don't see how that's going to happen. Hmm. Maybe I could find a way to get my hand on the serum. I don't see how anyone could get their hands on that serum. The military base is crawling with Sith guards. Breaking in there would be a suicide mission. I suppose the Sith patrols in the Undercity might have a sample of the serum on them, if they hadn't already used it because of a rat ghoul infection. But I doubt a patrol would just hand the serum over, and nobody is stupid enough to attack one of the Sith patrols, even in the Undercity. Don't worry, Zelka. I'll get that serum for you. Please, don't say that! If the Sith hear you, they might- I only mentioned the serum because you asked. Uh, let me see what you got for sale. Of course. Just... What do you got? Some med packs. Mm. Might as well buy a few med packs. I'll buy all your advanced ones. Thank you. Okie dokie. Psst, you there. Wait a minute. To talk to you about the rat ghoul serum. All right. What do you want? Zelka isn't the only one who wants to get his hands on the rat ghouls. Uh. I'd rather give the serum to Zelka. Helping people is all well, and, and then only the rich. If you find the rat ghoul serum. Shut up. I don't want to help Davik. He seems like a jerk.
How much time do I have left? 20 minutes. Alright. Where do we want to go next? Oh boy. Um... Map note, Droids by Janice. Oh, I've never been there before. What's that Droids by Janice? Speak to Karth. Yes, what's in your mind? Uh, is this a good time to ask you some questions? I guess I did say you could ask me questions. Not if you have a problem with it. No, no, I don't have a problem with it. This isn't an interrogation. No, I was just joking. Though, you do... Let me ask you something first, though. I've been going through the battle aboard the end. Some things that just don't add up for me. Why ask me? I don't see the point. I'm just trying to figure it out. I saw enough men lose their lives needlessly during the Mandalorian Wars. It lost the ship and a lot of good people. For what? We hope that the Jedi powers would save us somehow? We didn't choose that battle anyway. It got forced on us. Hell, I'm, I'm, I'm just a surprise. Come to think of it, it's more than a little surprising that you happen to be here, isn't it? I mean, just... I used to be a smuggler. A smuggler? I should have guessed. Isn't it odd, however, that... You'd rather I wasn't? Don't be ridiculous. You've more than proved yourself since the crash. We... Are you implying I had something to do with the crash? No. Well, maybe. Don't get me wrong, I just seem... Doesn't make any difference. Go ahead and be paranoid. I'm not trying to be paranoid. It's just that I learned a long... The Jedi requested numerous things when they came on board. Considering your connection to Bastille and the Jedi... I'm probably wrong. And this is... Shouldn't be trying to work together? I am working with you. I'd be a fool not to. God, I don't like him. He's so boring. Uh, you do know we're on the same side, right? Look, it has nothing to do with it. And no, I'm not going to discuss them, so can Yes, let's do that. Okay. Like I said before, I... Jesus Christ, Karth. Ugh. <laughs> I don't like Karth. I don't like Caden. I don't think I just like this guy who voices these characters. I don't find them good. Hello. Uh, what do they have against Twi'lex? You'd think people would be a little more tolerant. Let me see what you got for sale. Chili droids, what do they do? Small but tough. Let me see your droids. Um, tell me about the top of the line droid. Mm. Let me see your inventory. Nothing. Journal entry. How'd I get a journal? Purchase the droid. Hachu a punky. Uh, I want to ask you some questions. Do you want to think about the escape pods? Um, I'll be going now. Let's go back down to the... Listen to me, people. That is a terrible scourge sweeping up. Nobody cares about you, buddy. This elevator is off limits. It's obvious from. The I'll be going Move now. Ugh, have to wear the fucking Sith armor again. No problem. Didn't work. No. I don't want to wear the Sith armor. I don't like the Sith armor. It looks stupid. I wonder what's through here. Standard door. Lower city apartments. Oh, it's another apartment building. Oh. Sentry droid. Um. Repair the droid. Um. How many repair parts do I have? 14. 
Leave it alone. Alright. That's good enough, I think. Eh. Optimize the droid's weaponry and put it in patrol mode. Leave it alone. Bye bye, Mr. Droid. And I leveled up. Alright. Let's get myself some. Uh. Let's try. Let's get some charisma. No. Let's get some dexterity. Yeah. Do I still have more that I can do? Guess not. Skills. Um. Persuade. That'd be good. Um, repair. Sure. Security. And... Let's give myself another awareness. Alrighty. Ah! Did not see this guy coming. Sorry. Get items. <laughs> oh no, he destroyed my little robot. Lame. Rude. Rude and lame. Get the items. Karth, really? Jesus. You're really cramping my style, Karth. Got some remains in there. Oh, some more guys. Throw a grenade. <laughs> Take that. Got another apartment through here. Doesn't seem to be working. How'd you like that? Could do a grenade. No. I'll wait it out. There we go. Book our shock stick, heavy blaster, get items. There's a foot locker, get items. Supplies, get items. Let's change that blaster out, shall we? Heavy blaster. One six one eight. All right. Heavy blaster seems good. A little bit more powerful. Hmm. Oh god, it's this thing. All right. Get items. Twisted Rancor. <clears throat> Alright, I'm going to have to write this down. Ugh, I could just look it up, but I'm going to try to figure it out myself. Okay. Guts and Gloria, Chronicle of the Amazing Story of the Twisted Rancor Trio by Gilfos Uxaris. Um, I think... Let's see. Gilfos Uxaris is a name that popped up. A work in progress. The origins of what, blah, 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 eventually become the most famous band in the galaxy. The brains behind the group manager, Gilthos, which founded the trio, turn a date, 
a young senator named Alinda. The ploy worked, and Alinda became the first member of the band. Gail scrambled to find musicians to back her and signed a bith named Uja. Um, he signed Uja's brother Uji. Okay. The band struggled. Alinda was a fantastic, but Uja wasn't much of a musician. But Alinda threatened to quit. Gilthos fired Uja and signed another bith named Lupa. Of course, this didn't go over well with Uja's brother, and Uji quit. Fortunately, Lupa knew another musician named Photo, who joined to replace Uji. Led by Linda singing, the second incarnation of the Twisted Rancor Tree became quite popular in their home world of Taurus, eventually attracting the attention of local legitimate business Davik Kang. Davik asked Gilthos to bring his group in for a command performance. Gilthos agreed, realizing this would be his band's room. Unfortunately, Linda had hurt certain them. She had rumors about Davik and his ex exchange, fearing for her life. She refused to go to say to her Many felt that without Linda singing, the band would crumble, but Gilthos came up with a brilliant fan plan to serve the group of hiring Linda's sister, Ashana. It's the new lead singer on the eve. Period. Got Gilthos. Ashana can travel at Linda's level. Davik's informal time could have consequences for the hour. Okay. Trio was founded on Guts and Glory. There are no. Alrighty. So let's see if we can figure this out. I think what we want to do is we want to. We want to click on. Who do we want to click on? Who's the first one? That's Photo. Can I. That's a Shauna. I think we want a Linda first, I think. A Linda. Oh my god. Why can't I see the names of these things? Uji. Oh my god. Photo. No, not a Linda. Uja. Uji. I think it's Lupa. Then Photo. And then Ashana. Yeah. What's inside the crate? Chani Fire Armor, 50 credits. Ooh. Let's see. 19, 16, 18, 19. Mm. Much better armor. Gonna do that. And I think Karth, we're gonna give Karth. Uh, might as well give Karth the combat suit, right? There we go. Yes? Alright, let's get out of here. Low security door. Haven't come across any other bad guys. Let's see if we can get this open. No problem. Got it. Kipuna. Huh? Kava tumpa kupa yia moka paata. Chiyoka. Uh. What are you doing in here? This place looks abandoned. Chibedwa nani bobo. Tonk nabung sha nun yang. Tonk patoga smaktelia. Are you in some sort of trouble? Do you want to talk about it? Tong hai tuam jiji yumalithpa ang ninku takum justak miki grabal mogo. Kachi kachi chu aitha odunga. Maybe there's a way I could help you. We itha nadana itya. Um, maybe you could fake your own death. Tell me your plan. I might be able to help you out. Hmm.
I could get you a permacrete detonator. Alright. I think I could do that. I think I know where they have them. They have it at that that woman's store. That uh that lady. I don't remember her name though. That just takes me to the lower city. Have I really searched everywhere? I have. Alright. So we might as well leave and go get that permacrete detonator then. Mm -hmm. And actually, I think... Oh my god, I don't want to talk to Karth. Fuck off, Karth. I'm going to cut this video here, and when we return, not like ending the video, but I'm just going to put a cut in here and we'll be buying the Permacrete Detonator and returning it to that guy. Alright, alright, see you in like, now. Alright, and we're back, and I'm going to give the Permacrete Detonator to Matrick. Ajuta. I've got a permanent done, all right, but it'll cost you. All right, have the permanent detonator. Shagjikin Lord Jawata Uma Kava Volpa Mulji Gumana Kinkun Shachikin Nikin Kunoba Mulira Jikun Wama Kunbes Chinpala Muji Tunira. We should probably get out of here, right? Tony Pudu Rana no Prata don't know, Sarcha. It's you a penki. Mucha shak pangpa. Thinking kun no ba mulri raji kun takum just tak miki gravel mogo tong hai tuam ji. Light side points gained, experience received, journal entry added. I'm glad I could help you. All right, let's go collect on some of these bounties, shall we? Just a few of them. We haven't finished. I think it's the. There's a few of them we haven't done. We'll find out once we go to Zax. Is that his name? I think it's Zax. Eh. Yeah, Zax. Um, I've got a bounty I want to collect on. Um, tell them about Largo. I want 400 credits. Nice. I've got a bounty I want to collect on. Dia. Persuade, I want 400 credits. Nice. I have a bounty I want to collect on. Magic is dead. I want 400 credits. Uh, I'll be going now. Nice. <laughs> 1200 credits. What? Oh, no. We're leveling you up. Leveling you up. Alright. Um. Let's give you a bit of the treat injury. And then feats, we're going to give you let's see, improved power attack, improved power blast, implant level, improved power blast. Let's give you improved power blast. Except close. All right. What? 
Let's see, what else do we have to do now? Um, Droid, Karth, Rackle Serum, Selvin's Bounty, Bendax Bounty, Basla, Rapid Transit. Hmm. Alright, well. I'm going to cut off the video here, and in the next one, we'll just continue on trying to find Bastila, I guess. So, until next time, this has been Dance Bars. Like, comment, subscribe, leave me any questions if you want to anything. Follow me on Facebook, Twitter, Tumblr, Steam. Links are down below. And until next time, bye!